the rarest things to find in Bollywood movies is when films break the norms and showcase something that is beyond the ordinary content being produced constantly. This is done by narrating stories which make audiences uncomfortable and may just tell us important lessons no other creators dare to present on the big screen. Through this video, we're going to tell you about movies that focused on relevant and important topics at a time where we were constantly subjected to brainless content. We highly recommend these films that you may have not heard of. So here is Tried and Refused Productions with five relevant Indian films way ahead of their time. Videsh, Heaven on Earth. Whenever you think of Preeti Zinta, you always think of her performances in the commercially successful films like Veer Zara or Salam Namaste. But in our opinion, Preeti Zinta's career's best performance was in the Deepa Mehta directed 2008 title film Videsh, Heaven on Earth, a film which focuses on a young Punjabi woman who gets into an arranged marriage with an abusive and violent Indo-Canadian man and how she shifts base to Canada without knowing much about the family or person and gets constantly subjected to mental and physical abuse, suffocating in this toxic environment tune mujhe zehar to nahi diya The movie gives us an ugly yet true picture of domestic abuse in Indian families that is slid under the rug most of the time. Preeti Zinta as Chand is breathtaking to watch. Innocent and naive transitioning to a resolute and strong woman. Highly highly recommend this gem by Deepa Mehta. Bazaar, a film starring Smita Patel, Nasruddin Shah, Farooq Sheikh and Supriya Pathak, almost no one knows about is the 1982 film titled Bazaar. The movie directed by Sagar Sarhadi is a masterpiece and a film that focuses on the regressive practice of bride buying in India, narrating a story of how a young girl gets sold by her parents to an affluent family in the Gulf, even though the girl gets constantly reminded by her love interest that living such a life has no purpose and value in her life. The movie talks about these topics in the early 80s, at a time where we were seeing just heroes bashing up bad guys. Actors like Nasruddin Shah and Smita Patel really paved the way for future generations to focus on content rather than anything else. Agni Sakshi One of the most disturbing and nail-biting thrillers to watch was the 1996 film titled Agni Sakshi. Now I know that promoting a Nana Patekar film is not the most wise thing to do amid the Me Too movement, but this is my attempt to separate art and the person for a brief time. The film starring Jackie Shroff, Manisha Koirala and Patekar focuses on marital abuse and the tormenting experience individuals can have in a toxic and violent relationship. Nana Patekar as the disturbed and abusive Vishwanath is an absolute terror in every scene. You genuinely feel scared of his character and the constant physical and emotional torture he makes Manisha Koirala's character go through Main janta tha ki mat tum zinda aur ye bhi janta tha ki ek din tum zarur milogi lekin mili bhi to kis roop mein The entire film following a troubled marriage, change of identity and accepting one's past and welcoming people with open arms is a must watch for everyone. Great performances and a nail-biting film, wondering every step of the way what's going to happen next. Ijazat Gulzar was one of the most talented directors when he was actively directing films, picking out topics that were way out of the ordinary and which pushed boundaries. One such film that many people don't know about is the 1987 film titled Ijazat, starring Nasruddin Shah and Rekha. Based on a Bengali short story called Jatu Griha, written by Subodh Ghosh, the movie especially in 1987 when the film industry was marred by absolute crap content, focused on topics no one really dared to showcase on the big screen, from infidelity in marriage to women standing their own ground and fighting for the choice of how they want to live their life an aspect that was virtually absent in hindi cinema the movie showed us how every relationship is a two way street and it is justified to move away from something if you don't feel wanted or respected an absolute gem that shouldn't be missed by avid movie viewers Zubeda, a spectacular film directed by Sham Benegal and written by Khalid Mohammad, is the 2001 film titled Zubeda, a film which recounts the story of actress Zubeda Begum and how she fell in love with Maharaja Hanwant Singh of Jodhpur and married him. However, the story is much more complicated than that and focuses on facets of royal customs that will blow any layman away. Or M, this sleeveless blouse आपको नहीं पहनना चाहिए और पल्ला हमेशा सर पर रखना चाहिए. And your makeup, my dear. इसका भी कुछ करना होगा The movie showcases her tumultuous previous marriage, how a wife adjusts to a king who is already married, the relationship with his first wife, scheming family members who want all the royal inheritance to themselves, and the pure resentment and disgust shown by several factions to the new union. The film is an interesting tale of a shockingly true story, a situation and life experience unimaginable to the common man. 
and that was the list guys write down in the comments below if you have some video ideas for our channel please don't forget to follow me on instagram the handle is right in front of you follow me at jammy pants 4 also please support us by smashing the like button and subscribing to our channel for weekly content ahead thank you for watching